The right to a fair and speedy trial is a fundamental principle that many believe makes our country great. Nathan Wood is Brazos County's chief public defender. He says while the office has only been operating for three months, it's already making a positive impact. We've been doing really well. Uh, we've already taken on about 110, 115 cases on behalf of people accused of crimes in the Brazos County. Uh, most of those cases are misdemeanors, but uh, we've, we've also been helping people on some felony cases as well. While most of the legal cases seen in his office are misdemeanors, his team of attorneys and caseworkers are working to represent accused offenders both criminally and address the underlying needs they may have. Move some homeless people into housing. We've, we've helped clients who's, who have lost property in home fires. We have um, transitioned some of our clients into rehab for drug abuse and, and also uh, treatment for mental health. Thursday, Brazos County Judge Dwayne Peters met with the board that oversees the public defender's office and says the office is off to a great start. I think if you compare to other uh, public defender's offices that were, were that have started up from scratch like we did, I think we're really we're in good shape. Peters says he's proud of the work that's been done so far and is looking to see the office continue to grow. I think we have got a good team. I think we're doing well, and I, and I'm, I think the office that we've got is, uh, is really stepped up and is doing their job, you know, and so I'm, I'm, I'm excited with the way things are going. And Brian, Donnie Tuggle, News 3. Currently, the office is funded mostly through grants, and they've got four attorneys who handle about 20 to 30 cases each.